Hello! I think it's recording anyway. It's hard to tell. I don't know how this setup works, but either way, it should be recording. Uh, welcome back. We're going to be playing this. I need to actually click in the window so I can actually use the stupid controller. Gots dang it. There we go. Very cool. The last thing we did was go to town and then immediately accidentally tell What's-Her-Face to leave. So I don't know what I'm doing anymore. I wish I had not told what's her face to leave. So let's let's do some exploring here. Let's see what's going on. There's a chocobo wannabe over here. That's a hideous sound that it just made, but whatever. What do you do? Keep an eye on your purse. Don't even know how much money I have. Don't talk. Oh wait, he said something different. Oh no, he didn't. Never mind. What's in the building? Like, are there shops here? This appears to be some sort of food place. Oh, there's stairs there. I was wondering why I couldn't move. I'm like, what's going on? Yes. I thought she was going to give me tips, but no. It's a frog dude. You want to buy a treasure? 158 is any. Well, the dude told me to watch my purse, and I don't really have money to throw. So I'm just going to say no to that. This pro that's pro possibly a good deal, I don't know. Probably, possibly, something. Oh, that was that's the merchant from earlier then. Can I not, like, walk over here? I appear to be unable to walk that way. I'm not sure why. Go this way. What are you doing? It's a dog person. Well, there's two people I can't seem to talk to in there, but one dude's offering to sell me something. I don't know what to feel about that. Is there, is there, is there something hidden back here? Who am I talking to? Can I rotate the camera, actually? I can rotate the camera. Aha! Uh -huh. Oh wait, she's hi I see her. She's hiding in the freaking corner over there. Is there loot? It doesn't appear to be loot. What the heck is the point of that room? There's nothing in it. Hello. Right, well, she's just permanently lost to me then. Alright then. What's over here? It's a dude in a hat. Excuse me. I just woke up. Technically, I did fall off. I actually jumped off the cliff. Try the tavern. I did. Seems like the tavern is where I need to be. I'd like to talk to this dude. There we go. Sandflyer parts. Uh, sure. What does this guy have? Croc tier? I feel like I should buy some of these. A wooden rod. Ooh. Maybe. Not right now. Oh, so the baby frog is fishing bait. We'll investigate the whole fishing thing later. Not right now, though. It seems like I need to be in the tavern. But I was in the tavern, and it didn't seem to help me any. Thank you for the tip. I learned that earlier. Um, there really doesn't appear to be anything else here. I guess I got some sweet glasses. Hmm. Let's go back to the tavern, I guess? Oh, wait. Hold on. What's going on back here? How do I get over there? That is a good question. How do I get over there? Hmm. I'm very lost. It's gonna be 20 minutes of me just being lost here. Oh, there's a table there. That's why I can't go that way. Can I go this way? No. 
I go around this way? There we go. Maybe I can get some help here. Might be a store. I don't, don't talk to him again. Freaking lack of analog. Um, I'll buy you some food. Seems reasonable to me. You want to read the instructions? Four? Make the bar patron happy. Hmm. Okay. I uh, didn't really explain it, but uh, let's give him a sausage. I guess. And then a, perhaps, perhaps a wine. We'll get fancy. Give this man a wine. I'll see, that makes his happy go way up. I give him a steak. And maybe another wine. I'm just gonna go ham on the 5Z. Whatever, I forgot the name of the currency. 5Z items. And one more. Uh, gotta vary it, I forgot, so give him a sausage. And then a beer. This dude just, he just doesn't stop eating. There we go. The burp text moved. Go talk to... The information broker in front of the inn. The dude with the swirly glasses? Zinni, the currency's right there. I'm an idiot. I got panacea. Okay, what does this guy say? Really? What about your your lady friend here? All right. These people are so nice. I love these people. So in front of the inn, I'm, I'm thinking it's the swirly glasses guy. I can manage to navigate my way over here. Because the inn sign's right here. I never, I never went inside the inn. I didn't know there was a door for it. What kind of inn is this? Hello? 30 zenny. Uh, diary? Never mind. Can I get stuff from crates? Is that a thing I can do? I'm, just, I'm mashing the, like, use button constantly, and it doesn't seem like I can take things from crates and town and stuff. Maybe. Anyway. Yeah, alright. Uh, sandflower parts. Yes. <laughs> nice camera spin. Oh, come on. Uh, go. Oh. Sure, I'll read the instructions. Guess the broker's price by entering an amount. The amount is equal to or greater than the price. The broker will give you the information. You have four chances. Watch his reaction to get clues. No. Oh, God. Uh. How much are you willing to pay? 20? Is that low? I don't know. Is that high? Let's go 20. That's not enough. Hmm. He didn't seem too upset about that price, so what if we go something like 40? Just double it. Afraid that's not enough. Oh, there's a total there. Is that the total I'm paying? Hmm. I'm getting close, apparently. This is my last try, though. Uh, let's just go all out. 80. Apparently that's good enough. So am I paying 200? 
Or can I, like, let's... Can I retry this? What if I go straight to 80? No. I'm gonna see if going straight to 80 works, or if it's the total that it's looking at. That's not a bad amount. I think you could do it in one go with 100. Yeah, I bet you could do it in one go with 100. We'll just pay that, that's fine, whatever. Not gonna mess around too much more with that. I've already been in this town for like 11 minutes and done nothing. Behind the tavern. You have to find out the password to be able to meet him. You saw one leave? Try looking on the highway outside town. Okay. Will do, I guess. Seems reasonable. Where is where is the highway outside of town? Is it just like walking along this road? Should he be out here? Well, this looks different than what was last time. Also, that looks different from what it was last time. Transforms character into a dragon. Um, not right now. I don't know how tough this thing is, let's just hit it, see what it does. Holy crap, that hits like a truck. And we don't know how much HP it has. I don't feel particularly safe right now. Still don't know how close it is to dead. We can meditate, that won't do anything. We can use a healing herb. Uh, yeah. Let's pop a healing herb. I think I can soak one more hit. Blind? Oh. Hmm. I don't want to be blind. Do I even have anything? I have that. I don't really want to use a panacea on blind, but who knows. I don't actually remember how much those are worth. Am I going to hit? I did, on the counter. I missed that, though. Hmm. Probably should have turned him into a dragon. Mayhaps that would have made this fight a lot easier. Who knows? Oh. Hooray! Finally. I feel like I'm already under-leveled. Well, I leveled. So, maybe that'll help. I don't know. Now, from what I can tell, I did a quick test before this and actually gained a level on accident, but it's a random encounter. From what I can tell, the stat increases are set. They don't, there doesn't seem to be variance in that. There might be later when the stat increases are a bit wider. I keep forgetting I can do that. What's the menu? Man, I wish someone knew Cure in this party. There's a path there. What's up here? Nothing, really. There's a baggie there, though. I hope I'm not fighting another scorpion. Alright, fighting these. These I can handle. These are doofuses. Half the time they don't do anything, so... I would much rather fight these than another scorpion, all things considered. Nice parry. Alright, I get a counter? No. I hoping I could get a counter off and just finish it there, but whatever. How much XP do I get for this? 14. Six less than the scorpion at much less issue during the fight. Does it seem right? Arum. What is Arum? Apologies, I'm going to be opening this a lot. Used in camp to learn skills from a skill scroll. You what? <laughs> I don't know what that means, but alright. Let's go over here. I think this is just a random encounter map. And that would be the exit back to here, yeah. Oh, but wait! Fish spot! I don't have a fishing rod. I should have bought a fishing rod. Let's go, let's go visit it anyway, see what's going on. 
It's the X button in a spot where the fishing mark lights up to begin fishing. I don't have a fishing rod, so I'm just going to kind of explore for a bit. I doubt that, yeah, I doubt there's going to be any random encounters. Eh, nice and peaceful. I'm thinking what's going to happen is when I fish, it's just going to be like really long sets of just fishing. And I'll probably do that live. And then just kind of have one big old chunk. So what is it on about with the highway outside? Do I just need to walk around out here or am I... Never mind. I was about to say, or am I doing it wrong? But no, I found him. Hello. How kind. Oh, for God's sake. I don't have a thousand zenny. You learned the password. Is it password? In the tavern. Okay. Is there any, like, loot out here I can pick up? Or is it just that dude chilling? It's probably just that dude chilling. Yeah, let's go ahead and exit then. Exit stage southeast. I don't think that's how that phrase goes. Alright, back. To Sarai. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. Remotely right. Hello? That dude's got a sweet, like... I don't actually know what that is, to be fair. That's what you get for leaving me. Oh, wait. I told her to leave. Is she gonna rejoin me, or do I... Is she, like, just not with us ever again? Well done. You can come with me. I... Well, am I... Aren't I already getting the parts? The whole point was me to get parts for the stupid thing. Does she have a cure? She appears to have rejoined me. Does she have a cure? She has that one spell that's really loud. She does. They're actually both injured. Interestingly, she's still injured. I'm curious if I should, like, just go to the inn and rest? Oh my god, that animation. Look at it go. It is, it's just, it's just having a heyday over there. What do you want to know? Um... Nothing right now. But you. Vinny Vitrin Vino. Vinoc? Uh, we need to go to the... Should I go to the inn? It's 30 zinni. Uh... No. <laughs> we'll be foolish and not rest. For whatever god-awful reason I've decided to do this. It's probably the guy up here. Not him. We know the password. I figured it was this guy because the door's behind the uh, bar here. Can I just go through? I can. Nice.
Not really. How, how is selling sand flyers dangerous? That's actually a question I want to know. Ah. Under a hex. He's also got like a really beefy like horse guy behind him. Sandflyer Valley. That's where we grow all of our sandflyer parts. Sure. Sandflyer Valley Ho! Is it behind him? No? What's Horseboro doing here? To the south of the town. Okay. I imagine this has opened up another another path away from survive. I just leave, it'll be fine. You know what? Let's rest. It's it costs thirty zenny, it's a full heal. We're risking some MP, so let's do it. What's the diary? Oh that's save. Alright, yeah. Makes sense. That wasn't much of a sleep jingle. Oh, it asks to save when you sleep as well. Alright, cool. We will save, yes. And I still don't know what that two associations, two associations means. I think it might be related to, like, important story characters I've met or something like that. Not entirely sure. Either way, we need to go south. To a new area, indeed. Excuse me. Hello. Random encounter immediately. Gosh darn old RPGs. Oh, it's a scorpion. Um. I can't hit the goo very hard. Unless I use magic. And I don't know if Sever is still, like, got really weird audio. I adjusted some audio settings, uh, but she wasn't in the party, so I couldn't test it. But... It is magic, and we need magic, so let's cast it on Zim Mage Goo. And hopefully it's not crazy loud. Nice parry. No, it's not. Alright, so I did- I fixed the audio there. It wasn't terribly difficult to do, so it's not dead? Uh, I gotta say, the art in this game is really good. Like, I'm really, I really like the art. We'll kill the mage goo with him. The animations are nice. The actual style is nice. It's very fluid. I like it. Good art style. Thank God that missed. Does does uh. Status ailments survive battles, if that makes any sense to you. As in, like, if I get blinded, do, does it stay perpetually until I hit, like, a save or something? I need to figure this out. And now we can pretty easily handle these scorpions with two people. We didn't get a fantastic battle yet, though. I gave so much XP. And almost the entire rest bonus back. Or rest cost back, I should say. Um, where am I going here? Get up the thing. There we go. There's a rudder blocking the path. Yeah, yeah there is. <laughs> it's a true story. Nope, it's all magic. Uh, she hasn't leveled, so I kind of doubt she's going to be able to kill it in one go, but we are going to target separately for now. He's hit su surprisingly hard, actually. Oh, she did kill it in one hit. Nice. And these guys don't hit very hard unless they use magic, and I don't know if these can use magic. 
I'm just burning through her AP. Is there a way to get AP back other than sleeping? I wonder. Siva! Why does she pronounce it Seaver? So a Sever. Not sure. Ding. More power! I assume power is roll, physical, attack damage, wisdom's magic, obviously. Agility is probably dodge and hit chance. Maybe crit chance as well. What's CP? One up CP. I have four CP. I don't know what CP is, but I have some. Maybe we should like make a camp and see if I can maybe like figure out what learn skills thing is. Is it chest? A croc tier. Eight croc tiers, actually. Holy crap. Game doesn't give a lot of chests, but when you get one, it's a lot of crap in it. And a Scorpy Bro, which I'm going to actually use magic on, because I would like to kill him rapidly if possible. Is he strong against magic? Nope. He's dead against magic, specifically. Aww, oh, she didn't quite level. And items, eye drops. Cool. There's a handle. Which way do you want to turn it? Um, right? Uh, what did that open exactly? Nothing, as far as I can tell. Turn it left. So that should let us go that way now. Which I assume is the direction I should be going, but I don't know. I'm just kind of wandering around, it's fine. Oop, we got Goop again. Uh, let's get rid of Scorpid Bro. And I think the Eye Goo have less HP than the Mage Goo. Or I could kill the Scorpion in one go and just have to deal with the other stuff. Let's kill the Scorpion. That probably was not the best use of a sever. Considering it's probably almost dead because of that crit, but I don't know if it's gonna crit, so whatever. We should probably kill the Mage Goo now, because it does the most damage. And I feel like just physically hitting it, because she's got really low AP. That does no damage. Good lord. I feel like I should be saving her magic for stuff, but, like, what stuff do I save it for? She's not good in these fights without magic, so, there we go. You won a great victory. I like that pose at the end of battle. So her agility is way high, and it's going up way high, too. Crack to you. Get what Croc Tears do. Is that the healing item? Because I have a bunch of them. 20 HP to 1 can cure something. It's just water, apparently. That's not the button I meant to push. I keep hitting that button to back out, but apparently that's not what that button does. Either way, we can go over here now. Which allows us to come down here? Well, this does us no good. What's over here? A thing! A zone exit or something. Oh god, it's this thing again. Uh... I know I'm employing a different strategy than last time. I want to see if she can kill it in one go. Yes? No. It's gotta be close. I really need her to be able to, to one-shot those things. Otherwise, not terribly effective. We can kill two in, in this turn, though, so... And then we just have Ibro to deal with, who's not very good. Ibro is not very good at his job. As he proceeds to almost kill her. But, you know, not very good at his job, it's fine. I wonder if defending gives you AP back. 
Because it seems like you just don't have very much AP. I wonder if I'm underleveled. I hope not. I haven't even made it very far in the game. You want to operate the winch? Sure. Um... That takes us up. Okay, and there's a ladder which leads to a chest, which I want. So let's do that before we leave. Up we go. A brass helm. Oh, that's right. I really haven't given them any equipment apart from the starting stuff. She's got a fancy dress. So he doesn't even have a helmet. What does that do? Less agility, more defense. Okay, so weight drops agility by what appears to be an equal number. I think he should have defense and she should have agility. This well, is kind of how they're set up to begin with, so basically just repeating what the game has already set for me. Let's go up here. Hold hands, don't fall off. That's the weirdest looking, like, anchor setup they've got going there. Uh, could I have just done... No, I can't just walk that way. Okay. Am I going up there? What's over here? Nothing. It's a chest already opened over there. Where am I and what am I doing? This is due to the dog. Woof. Hello. I need stuff. I need seeds to grow parts. Is this another mini game? That that's a very small area. If you have a dog that can scent them out, can I borrow your dog? Hey, 25 zenny each. Um, it's 50. Let's just take both. I don't know what I'm doing, but I mean, dog seems kind of useful. I would like instructions. Uh, break after she uses a certain number of times. If it hits metal, it will weaken and break more easily. Remember where the dog stops. Does he just run around and I have to, like, a memory game here? Oh, this is gonna be awful. Oh, this is going to be awful. Oh, lord. See, so barked twice there. What did that mean? Oh, that music. I think there's one here. I'll take here. I think there's one, like, right above it. How to Sage's staff. Was it here or was it one up? Nothing. Go that way. Please, thank you. Hooray! I found ship parts. And then there was one up here somewhere, wasn't there? Is it here? Or is it one over? Nothing. Shovel broke. Well, apparently only get four digs. Those the breaks. I see what you did there. I got a Sage's Staff out of that, though, which is probably for her, if I were to guess, if anything. What does it do? Wow. You lose... I'll oh, see, she only loses one agility from this. Oops, that was the completely wrong button to push. I suck at buttons. What else is new? May as well give it to her. I mean, a straight increase in damage. Sign me up for that. Alright, well, we got the item we came here for, so... 
Let's make our way back to town. And then call that set there. Because I believe it's about time we end the video. Plus, I'm going to get in a bunch of encounters on the way back, I'm sure. I should heal her, shouldn't I? And she's about to die. Just blow all of our croc tears on it. I imagine those are basically worthless. I went the wrong way already. That didn't take very long. Alright. Hit it in the face. Uh, You can't really hit it in the face, but hit it in the face anyway. Is there like... Oh, wow, her damage. Is there a shop in town where I can get better equipment? Or is this my early game shop? Just coming here and finding items from this guy. Because that was a good staff to find. I bet there's a sword in there I could find, too. We need to go this way. Huzzah! And then the exit's right here. Wow, that zone is a lot smaller than the first time you went through. I like that. Alright, back to Sarai. And we're going to camp here. Let's see if there's anything new in camp, like skills I can learn or something. I don't think there is. Can I talk to her? How long has it been that he's been waiting there? What's going on in here? Nothing. The diary. Skill. Muster. Mustard? Master? Switching skills requires one aurum. Stock zero. What? What is this? What? I'm very confused. Uh, let's add. Yes. List. I shouldn't have done that, should I? No. Um... Shouldn't have done that, I imagine. Because I don't have any skills. And neither of them have unique skills, so... Basically just used an arum to do nothing. Alright, what is mustard? Change current master. What? What? Uh, let's rest. Is this like a free inn? Is that what that does? Because if that is true, I don't see a reason to ever use an inn. Too many things in this game that I don't know about. I'm going to have to investigate everything all the time. So did that heal me? Yep, that's just a free inn. I don't see a reason to ever use an inn again. Alright, well... That'll be it for now, I guess. Thanks for watching, and I will see you guys next time where we will finish up this whole get parts for what's-her-face storyline that we've been on since the beginning of the game. Thanks for watching. See you then.